Welcome back to Most Buffalo. It is National Literacy Month and Neonatal ICU Awareness Month. And in honor of that, Sisters of Charity Hospital is having a Babies with Books readathon. President of Sisters of Charity Hospital, Megan Aldrich, joins us to talk about this. So, where did this idea come from? So, this is the third annual Babies with Books readathon. Um, it's actually an international event wow. that has had significantly increasing participation year over year. So what do you have to do? Like, how does it work? Do you read, is it reading to babies, I assume? It is okay. reading to babies. <laughs> yes, it is. Um, so reading to even our youngest patients yeah. is incredibly important. Um, it has been shown that reading to neonates uh, decreases stress, it supports neonatal brain development, and of course what's most important is it really supports family bonding. So in order to participate, um, we're able to um, just really pop online. There's a wonderful suite of materials that Babies with Books publishes, um, and we are able to engage in a friendly competition <laughs> between NICUs. Um, and what we do as a team is individuals log hours reading to our babies. Oh. And so mamas read, administrators read, the nurses read, and the NICUs that log the most reading hours. And by the end of the week, this will really be up to thousands of hours for our patients. Wow. Yeah, that's yeah. fantastic. So it started today <laughs> and it goes through, like, is it 24 seven? It is like a marathon? Wow, seven. okay, yeah. all right. <laughs> yeah, so, um, and that's because, you know, babies at this age have intermittent sleeping patterns. Oh yeah. <laughs> so what, I'm sure you know, yeah. yeah. So whenever they're awake and whenever they're alert, moms or caregivers are, are able to read to them. So 24 seven, we are logging our hours and supporting that brain development, which is just so exciting. It's gotta be relaxing for the adults too. And there are some books here that I have not read and the artwork is fantastic there's a book about little otters yes, so cute. yes I love you yeah. like no otter so we had wonderful participation in our donation program and actually this afternoon we were visited by Maston Councilwoman Zanetta Everhart who donated many books from her own not-for-profit yeah. so this has really been a wonderful community engagement for sisters and just a wonderful way for us to care for the whole patient and the whole family um, and of course with some amazing amazing books. If someone wants to take part where do they need to go? So they can certainly contact us at Sisters of Charity. We are always delighted to support our program directly um, and then also if they want to participate with Babies with Books generally um, there is a wonderful website if you just google Babies with Books um, you can find your local NICU, um, which certainly would be sisters. Um, and, you know, we're more than happy to engage and take donations and find ways of participating. So excellent. Thank you so much. That was president of Sisters of Charity Hospital, Megan Aldrich. Thank you for being here on Most Buffalo today. We appreciate it. Thank you so much for having me. It's been a pleasure. Sure.